in her dead skin. This how I'm gonna tell you how I caught you. Cause I do the same thing. No! And today I have a special guest. It's, it's your right. boy B. Butter the better. So today we're going to do random facts about us. So I thought this video would be really cool because I do want to start introducing him to my channel and all that good stuff. You know what I'm saying? So what better way than to tell you guys random facts about the both of us? And y'all already know me, but y'all gonna know more about me. Today I'm gonna be eating. Mr. and Mrs. Crab. Some people, if you're not from Florida, you don't know about it. But it's like juicy crab a little bit, crafty crab, same thing. They all have the same exact concept. And then he is going to be eating because he doesn't even like seafood like that. Chili and rice made by your girl day. By me, yours truly. I be throwing down. I be throwing down. So we're gonna have our questions. I think he wrote his down on a sheet Notepad. of paper. I'm a real dinosaur, I'm beyond all that electronic stuff. And then I wrote mine down on my phone. So we're just gonna be eating, chit chatting, real straight to the point. Nothing too crazy. Y'all, like, I'm so excited about this. Like, oh my God. I'm not really tripping, good. I just need a plate. I'm gonna put this here. Like, I know this is so crazy, like, that we're eating in a bed, but. Whatever. Oh, this looks so good. Y'all, in college, I guess this is one fun fact about me. In college, I used to eat seafood like every other day. I couldn't go like, oh crap, I forgot a fork. Can you give me a fork? Thank you, baby. Oh, they treat you like you in there, huh? No, I asked for fork. You wanna go first or you want me to go first? I go first. Okay. A fun fact about me, I've been paying people to do my homework since the second grade. Mm. My dad used to give me, what, like $3 for school? Mm -hmm. Then I used to make an extra two to three dollars by mopping the house, and I'd rather just pay people to do my homework than do it. So I had more time to do stuff that I really cared about, like watching Dragon Ball Z. I hated Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> what? I hated Dragon Ball Z. I hated that. I hated anything that looked like anime or came on Cartoon Network. The only thing I like about Dragon Ball Z, sometimes it take them like six episodes to fly to to a fight, but then if. <laughs> If they want some Next time on Dragon Ball Z. still Goku still flying to go say these niggas. We six episodes in. Then, if he want, he could just chill and be there in two seconds. That don't make no sense. Okay. Well, that is an interesting fact. So, mine, I gotta get some sweet tea. So, I drink Pure Leaf. This stuff is so good because I would spend, oh, I guess that's my next interesting fact. So, I used to literally spend a dollar every single day for like dollar minimum. A dollar minimum every single day for McDonald's sweet teas. Cause I drink sweet tea every single day. And that was happening for about like a year. Or maybe longer than a year. Mm -hmm. And that's why I bought these. So I buy these in like the big packs. Because like my obsession with sweet tea is like out of this world. I already have another one right on deck because I already know how I be smacking these. So that's an interesting fact about me is I drink sweet tea every single day. Every day. I've been to Vegas more than 20 times, but I've only walked the strip probably three. Me and my brother, for what, three? It's been three years now. We go to Vegas all, all football season, every week, and we just bet on college sports. We'll do a video separate about that. One of mine, let me find one. I'm mixing it up. I'm not gonna do them in order. This is hot and I only got medium. Oh, this is an interesting one. So I only own like four pairs of panties. And they not even real panties. They like, yeah. they like G-strings, like little strings. And the only thing that it covers is like my hoo-ha. So don't ask me why. Well, I'm gonna tell you why. But anyways, so I, I, I do that because um, I just don't like wearing underwear. You never wear underwear. Mm -mm. Only time you really wear, well, you don't even wear underwear then, but you wear boy shorts. I guess that's underwear. When I'm on my period, yeah. And that's how I know when she's on her period. Yeah, cause I wear, I, I have two pairs of boy shorts. <laughs> that sounds gross. <laughs> <laughs> Your period on with three, four days, would you rotate them? Nah, but okay. Oh, I know this is gross, so TMI guys, ew. I just spit everywhere. Right. TMI, but like, 
sometimes even then I won't wear underwear. Like, I just, you know, my cycle is really light. So I don't, you know, it only lasts like four days. So I just be cooling and boiling. You know, after like the first and second day, after them two boy shorts is up, <laughs> I'm like, uh, okay, I'm good. Maybe we should go, maybe I should go again. I should get two and you get two. Okay. Okay. Um, another one. Let me see, let me see, let me see. I hate having to unlock my phone. Like, I'm really good at cracking crabs open. Like, I be getting all the meat, okay? Literally. Mm. So, another interesting fact about me is that I never have, like, really been single. Like, in my 25 years of living. It's so crazy to say, but it's like, oh, it's a fact. In college, I mean, forget college, like in elementary school, like, I was seven years old with a boyfriend. Like, everybody always wanted to lock me down, you know, because I'm like, I'm her and she's me. Seriously though, like, I really always had a boyfriend. It was so crazy. Um, that was like, up until the point I had, well, I still have a boyfriend now, but he's more like my husband, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But yeah, like I literally always had a boyfriend. Every time somebody would hear that I was single again, they would always be on my trail, okay? And do, the last time. Shut up. <laughs> they would be on my trail, y'all, okay? When was now? They be on your trail before you send. I be sending the DMs. Yeah. Boy, so if you leave, boy, just hit me up. <laughs> oh damn, I ain't even gone yet. No facts. Oh, nothing mad or nothing. Be a happy picture. Yeah. Y'all ain't happy tomorrow. Him and the damn, boy. Mm-hmm. Like what? Hard to make a mistake. Mm-hmm. That bring me into my next fact, baby. What? I've only had, I'd say, three real girlfriends in my life. Y'all, that's a lie. <laughs> that is a lie. One. Mm -hmm. But my last girlfriend, we was in a relationship for like 10 years. Mm -hmm. And then the one before her. Who was before her? You don't know. We'll see that for the next, uh, next video. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. Mm -hmm. I'll always tell him, like, he's never been in like a real relationship. Like, ever. What you mean? I mean, you've been, you said it. I've never been in a real relationship. Like. It wasn't real, real, cause it was real, don't get me wrong, but it wasn't real, cause we was uh, in different cities for most of it. Long distance relationships don't count. All right, then I ain't been in a real relationship. But you've only talked to one girl your whole life. No, that's, so you don't confuse them. I've had sex with multiple women. I just always had a girlfriend. It's a Miami lifestyle. What? I didn't even know that was a problem. <laughs> Why you was having sex with other girls? Of course. At least you're honest about it. I was a player for most of my life. So. Oh my God, they gave me two. Look at this, guys. That's Ooh. awesome, no? It looks so good. Guys, this was worth it. This was so worth it. I'm so happy. Oh. I started shooting dice. In the sixth grade, I actually used to go to school just to shoot dice. Like I would wake up in the morning, get ready, grab my dice, run to school real fast. Cause we really used to gamble in the beginning of school, I mean before school started, and during lunch. One hour later. Middle school, sixth grade, that's when I first started. Really shooting, I learned in the fourth grade cause my brother taught me in the sixth grade. Two hours later. When he was in the sixth grade and I was in the fourth grade. Land the plane! <laughs> but I ain't start shooting against people I wasn't related to till sixth grade. You can add it all that. Well, now he's done with his school. But I'm gonna buzz down by the piano. Sometimes I have to wear earplugs when I go to sleep. Cause this one right here sleeps with the TV on like a hundred. I'm gonna be on the damn hundred. He has to sleep with the TV on. You just sleep light. Don't blame me. You just sleep light. If I move, <gasps> y'all, I be having like that is really crazy. If I go to sleep and he doesn't go to sleep like with me, I'll like wake up in the middle of the night, like 
Like on some crazy shit. It's so bad. I be I have to contemplate if I should go pee or not. Like damn, <coughs> if I move too much, she gonna feel me. So I'm really like trying to sneak out the bed before I get out. Here. <gasps> I'll say shit crawling on my ceiling. I was just about to say that. That's why I was looking at y'all. I was like, you remember that time you woke me up, telling me it's a lizard? Oh, I woke him up, y'all, and told him it was a lizard in our room. Like I saw it climbing right on. Like it was crawling all through. Like dead ass. Woke up in the middle of the night. We turned on the lights, remember? I remember. <laughs> it was like 3 o'clock so in the morning. Like, hey, there's no lizard in here. No, <laughs> like, like, it's a lizard. It was so big. you like, it's right there. It's right there. Cut on the light. There's no lizard right there. Bro, you know, and then I woke I up. Was a, so mad. I woke up again, y'all. And I thought it was climbing on our headboard. So I'm like, yo, I'm not tripping. I swear to God, y'all, like, Sometimes I'll be sleep and I'll see stuff in my room and it's always animals. Like if y'all into that kind of stuff, like tell me what that may mean. Of course, it was not a lizard in the room. <laughs> but it's not even just then. Sometimes I be sleep and my, I did it to my homegirl before too. Here's a interesting interesting here's an interesting fact. Interesting. Interesting. I got 14 siblings. Like brothers and sisters, I met one of them in Haiti and ba on vacation, like very casual. My dad takes us to Haiti all the time. Been there a couple of times and just, I think it's like on our fifth, sixth trip, we there. Um, so oh, you got a brother? <laughs> yeah, just, he just came to the house. Nobody even said nothing, and we just everybody looking at him like, damn, he looks just like Rudy. But just his brother. We're like, who is this? They're like, oh, that's your brother. I'm like, man, stop lying. No, for real, that's your brother. For school, I went. For college, I went to five different colleges in three different states. And you ain't know that. I'm. Well, you knew, but you don't really know. You went to five different colleges? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I first started off, I was supposed to go to a junior college in Kansas. We went there for like two weeks and a fight broke out. Then we ended up going to a junior college in California. Then after that, I, I came to Tallahassee. I went to TCC. Then I went to Louisville. Mm -hmm. Then I came back. I mean, I came back to Tallahassee and went to family. Oh. No degree. <laughs> There's no way I would do all that shit with no degree. In the end. I'm lying, I'm lying. I graduated, y'all. Sort of, kind of. That's a whole nother story. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not going to five different colleges and not getting that one degree. But the whole time I ain't doing it for me. I'm just doing what my mama tell me to do. That's, That's crazy. That's another thing. Live for you, man. Bye. don't know what's good for you. Bro, I'm telling you, like, I know so many people who are, like, college dropouts. High school dropout, and I make a millions right now. And people who graduated college just barely can find a job in their career. Like, y'all set us up. And I ain't gonna lie, I, for me, it's I'm just being ignorant. I could go get a degree. What's the one they told me I could get? Oh, interdisciplinary studies. Yeah, they'll give me that one. But I went to school for uh, communication and journalism. And when I went to pick up my degree, as of re recently, I graduated in what year? Well, I thought I graduated. <laughs> 2016. So like I got with her, she like, I heard her auntie telling her go pick up her degree. I'm like, damn, I never picked up my degree. Mm -hmm. So when we went to the office, they're like, oh, you, we never sent you a degree because you you're don't... missing one credit. So I need to take Spanish too. That... I'm just not gonna do it. I'm just like, man. I'm gonna end up doing it for him. But I feel like even with that, like one credit, but you still making hella bread. Exactly. That's crazy. I wouldn't. I'm not gonna lie, I would do it just because it's one credit, but if I'm being honest with y'all, like, I feel like, and I know this is like off on a tangent, but I really feel like parents, like especially our generation, like, we're gonna be having kids soon if you don't already have kids, please, like, I definitely feel like school teaches kids structure, but, let me chew. Do not force your kids, like, to go to college, like, even if they don't wanna go to college, just make them find a trade, you know, like a trade. I heard like trade schools be making so that's much. That's where the money at. Yeah, because that's what I people that need. Yo. Man, I had a general contractor. He, uh, well, a, a project manager. So he opened up the computer for me. Not, I'm just, I like to, I pay attention to everything around me. So he's trying to scroll down real quick to uh, show me how my breakdown of pay should, should be. And I'm just looking at all the trades. I'm like, wait. Roofer made what? The plumber made what? I'm talking, they got drawers. Brand new construction being built. 280,000. That's just a draw. So that's a two week period. That's what they get. What are you saying? Draw? It's, it's a draw. That's, in construction, it's called a draw. So 
you bid, say you, you bid for something, uh, it's gonna cost me a million dollars to do all the plumbing here. Every two weeks or every month, it's a it's a draw. So oh, I'm thinking, no, no, because you be saying draw. Like draw, no. Like drawer, drawer. Drawer. <laughs> the <good. laughs> Look, yeah, there's money everywhere. You ain't gotta go to school. Fact. If you go into school, don't go to school to be what you want to be. Go to school to enhance what you are. Ooh, spicy. So okay, this is like a funny little fact. I was in like elementary school, right? And. I had like an obsession with like pregnant people. Just the look of them. I used to like how pregnant people look. I don't know where I got it from. But I don't know if story either. Yeah, I was really weird about it. So all the way from like second grade to fourth grade, I lied to all my teachers and told them that my mom was pregnant. You know, it's like it, a lie is only a lie when you get caught in it, right? <laughs> One day. My teacher had a, a, a parent conference meeting with my mom. Mind you, I'm telling these people this shit for like two years. <laughs> and so, my mom came in one day and I'm like, oh my God, your daughter is so excited about the new baby. <laughs> <laughs> your mom caught off guard. She like, baby. And she's like, yeah, didn't, weren't you, aren't you pregnant or didn't you have your baby? And she was like, no. When I tell y'all, I was so fucking embarrassed. I wanted to get transferred to a new special. So at the time I was in music, I think it was like my music or art teacher. <laughs> and I'm like, y'all, I'll catch y'all bullet, I'm going to PE. <laughs> and one more is, I braid my hair every single night, no matter what. Can't you attest that? She does, unless you got have too much drink. <laughs> you know, I don't ever braid your hair when you be drunk, but I take your contacts out. How do you take my contacts out? But he does do that. He takes care of me. Put my finger in your damn eye. <laughs> do you? Remember that time I no, you out? no, you tell me, babe. Wake up and take them out. Sometimes, but that time your contact ripped. I remember when the guy ripped mm -hmm. after we were drinking. You know, and you like, damn, I ripped it when I pulled it out. I tried to do it myself. I ripped it. I just ain't gonna. I ain't admit it. To really? It. <laughs> oh wow. So we gonna do one last one and make this one juicy for y'all. It can't be nothing crazy inappropriate. It's not inappropriate. Okay. It's a fact. Mm -hmm. Something that really happened. Okay. It happened by us acting in a inappropriate manner, but it happened. Ah! <laughs> I already know what it is. Hold on. Look at my hands. Let me wipe my hands because I gotta get ready for this one. You already know what it is. They don't. I know. But I'm just like, let me do mine first. Okay. So, Damn. I got on you. Almost. I actually did a good job, but Jesus Christ, thank God I had this on. I don't know. I didn't make no. Okay, 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 okay. okay. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna just. You can't even. You know where it is. Okay, so I'm gonna just say one because it's like, whatever. But one is that. I make up the bed before I go to sleep every single night. <laughs> but it's not true. Like, I make up the bed in the morning, but I also make it up before I go to sleep. And Brandon, I can't, I can't get them this if that's what you're gonna want. Brandon, I, don't, I can't think of nothing else. Come on, with something better. Okay, hold on. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Oh. All right, you, that's that's a that's a. That's just as good as me telling them I'm a licensed roofer in the state of Florida. If you need your roof done, reach out today and we'll come out that up for you. That is not the same. This is good. That's not spicy. I got a simple one better than that. I still eat my own dead skin. Ew, that's disgusting. And I've been hiding it from her this whole time. Ew. You know, like, between my toes, you don't see how I be done set the skin down. That's nasty as fuck. Well. You better be lucky. You, talk you, talk you, talk you, you for a while go back. He better be lucky he with me forever because the bitch wouldn't talk to him. I would. Because <laughs> I eat my dead skin? Yes. Hey. <laughs> you eat your dead skin. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't <do> me. <laughs> no, I do not. Why? You think you lying? You know that time I caught you in your dead skin? Yeah. The callus in my hand, I'll be in there. Well, everybody did that when there was a gym. I still do it, and you too. No, I'm not. I caught her in her dead skin. This, I, I'm gonna tell you how I caught you. I do the same thing. No! You know, you he's feel, lying! You 
you feel your skin, but you see somebody watching you, so you sit the skin down strategically, you, <laughs> you, <laughs> you go on <laughs> casually in the conversation. Shut up! And you come back up and yeah, yeah. Brady, I, lying. Brady, I called you, man, you had a whole talk about it. No, we you had a no. You thought I would discuss, but I was looking at I found my match. <laughs> just like, so you're lying. My skin and all. I thought you I thought you been peeing me, but you just don't say nothing because you do it too. No, you I don't hide it like that. No. I that I really did not like I don't do that. Don't let him lie to you. I don't do that shit. Yeah, that's the one I'm gonna end on. I'm gonna save my that last spicy for the one story time. For a story time. I thought he was gonna give y'all the tea, but he's not gonna give y'all the tea. But let me take if you this. give me one, if you can get on one. Just close to that, I got it. Yeah. If not, I'll save it. We'll just have to save it because I can't think of anything nah, right now. I'm making bed up. I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we'll do a part two. Comment down below, let us know if you want a part two because part two is going to oh, be yeah. straight so, look, spiciness. So, who facts y'all feel like was more like, feel me? Yeah, you don't say nothing, but you be like, you feel me? You know what I'm trying to say. I just can't come up with a word. I mean, they're, mine were really like real random, interesting facts. Mine. Yours was, oh, when I was five years old, That's I started betting. I told him I met one of my brothers. I like, hey, those some fire shit. You giving them uh, make up the bed when I went. I mean, that's so, interesting. Some people really don't. Like, I have it's, much more, but we'll do a part two. Maybe. Uh, but y'all tell us who, who y'all like the better. Just, if you like me better, say the better. If you like the other, say day. Okay, the and, and get this video to like 100 likes and we'll do a part two. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. We really enjoyed it. We hope you guys enjoyed it. Stay safe out there during this quarantine and this pan slash epidemic. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification, and you'll have all my videos ready for you when I post. And, you know, of course, until next time, toodles.